What is that? Oh my god, it's the... It's the, uh... It's, it's the ladder. Jacob's Ladder to Hell. <laughs> Freaking Jacob's Ladder. You're climbing and climbing, you never get to the top. Ah! Ah! And seeing it over a pool was very nerve-wracking. Hi, everyone. Hi. This looks great. Well, you all made a splash at makeovers this week. In tonight's challenge, a splash is the last thing you want to do. I think tonight's challenge is pretty straightforward. You each have a Jacob's Ladder suspended above the pool. All you have to do is keep climbing it. If you stop, you will fall 10 feet into the water. Once you hit that water, you are out of this game. The last player remaining wins. All right, this challenge has started. Everyone on their ladder. You're 10 feet above the water. First of all, it is way faster than what I'm used to. Second of all, we're suspended in the air. This thing is like tilting back and forth, wobbling, bouncing. And I'm like, are you kidding me? If you slip, if you do anything, like you're in that water. And I will not be the first person in that water. The closer we get to the end of this game, the like more important every single pound is. I started to try to like stare at a point. And I was like, I'm just going to stare at this point. I'm not going to stop looking at it. And I'm just going to climb. Ashley's a rung behind everyone else. She is getting close to the end of her ladder. I'm climbing up the rungs. I'm feeling each rung just going. And I'm feeling that bottom rung on my foot already. And I just start, I'm panicking. All I have to do is beat one person. Just stay on this ladder until you hear a splash. The quick step, Ashley, regaining some of that lost ground. <laughs> then again, falling behind. Ashley in the water. She's the first one out. Three minutes in, Ashley in the water. Ashley with a one pound disadvantage at the way in this week. Three and a half minutes? I'm final six. And I fall off the Jacob's ladder at three and a half minutes. Like, I'm just really disappointed in myself. Still fighting for that one pound advantage. Whoa. Good workout, Mike. Ah. Here, Mike. That's Mike. Mike, the second one in the water, five minutes in. Whoa. 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 Mike falls in. I look over, and I'm the only girl up here with all these boys trying to keep up with them. And I'm like, all right. I have a feeling this is where the game's gonna get tough. No one is falling off. Everyone's staying on there. I couldn't believe it, because the three minutes I was on was pure hell. One hour, guys. That's one hour you have been climbing that ladder. With each step that he takes on this ladder, and each each foot that he climbs, it's, it's, it's his climb to success. It's his climb to confidence. It's his climb to a to this new collie that's been developed and framed here at the ranch. And exactly two and a half hours. This challenge oh, yeah. is over. Yeah. Two and a half hours. There is held off. Collie wins it. Holy congratulations, you have won a one pound advantage at the weigh-in this week. What happened in this challenge? We had to do the Jacob's Ladder to Hell, and it was over a pool, and the first person to fall in got a one pound disadvantage. Ooh. This guy. So, I'm, I'm prepared to deal with that. I'm fine, I'm not stressing about it, and I'm just picking it up. All right, so what else happened? Some really amazing stuff happened last night. Yeah. Some people were on the Jacob's Ladder for two and a half hours, nonstop. What? Yeah. Please raise your hand. No, you couldn't have been. You were on there no, for two you, and a half hours? You know, Darius and I raised our hands. And for me, that was a moment of pride, you know, because I don't think Bob was expecting me um, to hold my hand up. I think he was expecting Sam and Darius to. Um, so that look of shock was kind of like, yeah, it was me. Who won out of the two of you? I won. 
immunity? One pound advantage. A one pound advantage? It was football. Right. Yeah. I mean, I, we were talking, oh, Darius and I were talking after Sam fell, and I was like, Darius, I, I want you to have that one pound, but I can't let you just win. I want to win. Like, this is all for pride. At that one moment, when he goes flying off that treadmill, falls flat on his ass, it's like, stand up and finish what you started, and that's exactly what Darius did. 10, 9, last chance, 8, 7, 6, 5, that's it, 4, 3, 2, one. Jump off. Unbelievable. Because that's who you are. Unbelievable. We're going to do that again. Telling Bob that I gave up on the challenge and him pushing me harder than he ever has before gives me more inner strength and more confidence in what I can do and the fact that I can finish this and I can win this. And you're going to see me up on that podium at the finale and I'm going to do everything I can be number one.